Hello and welcome to this learning video. In this learning video, we are going to start a topic named as first order differential equations. And under this topic, we have different equations that we will learn in the upcoming learning videos. So the equations that we are going to learn in this under this uh, broad topic of first order differential equations are exact differential equation second one is the linear differential equation uh, and the next is uh, the Bernoulli's equation which is also known as reducible to uh, reducible to linear differential equation so and after that we will see the application part of this first order differential equation to simple electrical circuit okay so that this would be the scenario of the entire uh, topic which is uh, first order differential equation so as i said we are going to discuss here the first order uh, first order differential equation and the very first topic under this is exact differential equation so let us see what is this exact differential equation is okay so a differential equation of the form a differential equation a differential equation of the form of the form m dx plus n dy is equal to zero is said to be is is said to be an exact is said to be an exact differential equation exact differential equation if if there exists a function if there exists a function say u there exists a there exists uh, okay there exists some function u some function there exists some function u such that such that what is it such that this m dx plus n dy is equal to b u okay where m and n are the functions of x and y so this is nothing but the definition of difference exact differential equation now let us see the condition of exactness which is very important as far as the exam uh, example solving is concerned so next is condition condition for condition for exactness so when you solve problems you will get uh, m and n okay and if you want to see the given differential equation is exact or not, we just need to uh, find out derivative of m with respect to y. Of course, the partial derivatives because they are the function more than one independent variable are there. And find out del n by del x. And see whether they are same or not. If this both the quantities are same, then we say that the given differential equation m dx plus n dy is equal to zero is an exact differential equation now after the condition of exactness there is the thing like a solution of solution of what is that solution of exact differential equation so once you uh, check whether if the equation is exact then this uh, solution of exact differential equation is exact differential equation so it is like integration of m dx keeping y constant plus integration of terms of n integration of terms of n containing terms of n containing 
y only and if there are some constant term they have to uh, consider you also have to consider the constant term also the terms of n containing y only dy is equal to constant okay so this is the with the help of this you can get the solution of the exact differential equations okay so remember this word because uh, this is the easy topic but student get confused and they write almost all the terms of n and which leads to incorrect answer of the exact differential equation okay so if these three things are clear to you then we can move towards the uh, method working rule or the method of solving the exact differential equation so what is the first thing that we have learned the very first thing that we have learned is the exact differential equation so a differential equation of the form m dx plus n dy equal to zero is said to be a exact differential e equation if it has a primitive primitive means there exists some function u such that m dx plus n dy is equal to du right then we have seen the condition of exactness which is del m by del y equal to del n by del x followed by the solution of exact differential equation which is integration of m dx plus integration of terms of n containing y only dy is equal to constant okay so let us take uh, now the method of solving the exact differential equation writing it as method of method for solving method for solving method for solving okay best way we write working rule working rule that is the method of solving that we are going to discuss here so the very first thing is uh, the very first step when you are uh, dealing with the topic of a first order differential equation and especially the exact under the topic so the very first step is write down the given equation write down the given equation of the form of the form what is that m dx plus n dy is equal to zero that is the first step simple and the easy one second step says write write m and n okay first we have to arrange sometimes the equation uh, are arranged sometimes you have to arrange the equation in the form m dx plus n dy equal to zero and then you write m and n then third we have to check whether the given equation is exact or not so condition of right m and n okay third one is find del m by del y find del m by del y and del n by del x and check and check whether Check whether del m by del y is same as del n by del x. Okay, and if it is so, then at last we can write down step number four, the solution. Okay, if number four, if del m by del y is equal to del n by del x, then find the solution. Then find the solution as this okay so this is the working rule for uh, the 
first order differential equation namely the exact differential equation so i hope the things that we have covered in this learning video is clear to you because this is the easiest topic and uh, but sometimes uh, you may uh, commit some mistake in the easiest of easy topic okay so i want you to go through it very precisely then only we can uh, able to solve problem perfectly okay so i hope this is clear to you thank you for watching this learning video keep learning thank you